Hello and welcome back. My name is Amulli and you are watching Nishal. In this video, I'm going to show you how to compile and run Java code on Microsoft Windows 10. So if you've got Windows 7, 8, it should work. Okay. So make sure you already have Java JDK JRE. That's Java JDK means Java Development Environment. Okay, Kit also. And then JRE Java Runtime Environment. Both installed on your system. So the very simple thing you can do is go ahead and install JDK 13, like 11, 13 of Open JDK 14 as well. So let's go ahead and make sure it's installed. So I already have downloaded it, extracted it, and put in this folder. So it's 64 bit. So here we have JDK 14. Let's go ahead and uh, put the set the what do you call it system path and also the class path for this. Java JDK. So if I go ahead and type Java version, it doesn't recognize it. Okay. So similarly, if I go ahead and say Java C, it doesn't recognize. If I say J shell, it doesn't recognize it. So to fix it, this is the very first thing before you start compiling and running Java code on your system. So make sure you have already installed your JDK. Go to your JDK folder wherever it is, 32-bit or 64-bit, doesn't matter. Go ahead and open this bin folder, copy this location over here, and then close it. And then go to your start menu, type variable, and you'll get very first option that says edit system environment variables. Go ahead and hit enter and go to environment variables and now we need to go ahead and set the system path so make sure you are doing in this system variables okay and then go and look for this uh, path okay it may be slightly different on windows 7 and 8 so once you have selected path go ahead and hit edit and now hit new paste that bin folder location over here and then hit OK. There's one more thing that we need to do. We need to set the Java home path so that we can run JRE. We can run JRE command, that's a Java, to uh, run our Java classes after compilation. So we need to do by creating Java home variable. So go ahead and click New. And type Java home in uppercase like this Java home and then paste that home location of your JDK okay similar same like this one go ahead and hit okay 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 now go ahead and launch your terminal make sure you are relaunching your terminal close all the terminal terminals like command prompt and start it again so go ahead and type Java and say hyphen version and hit okay so you can see open jdk version 14 ea which is still kind of this is experimental thing here now let's go ahead and try, try java compiler let's go ahead and try jshell so everything is working you can see it now we need to go ahead and quickly compile code and run it so let's do that i've got something um, over here so this is very simple code you can write in java and i've got set up my command prompt so as soon as i press Control shift t it opens the command prompt in relative or wherever i am in the same folder okay now so i am in here let's go ahead and compile this so to compile you simply type java c and the name of the java file that is hello okay hello or java so i already have compiled it before but this is how you compile it so you simply say java c name of the 
file as it is so in uppercase and then dot java hit enter this is going to compile it it's been compiled you can go ahead and have a look and you can see i've got hello world dot class so that's compiled java code now we need to run it so to run it we simply go ahead and say java and you don't need to say java hello world dot class but that should also work okay so you simply say java so now you're going to use jre that is going to uh, run the java class okay so let's go ahead and hit enter and this is hello world one more uh, file that i have here i can go ahead and say pure i've got pure dot java and it's been compiled now i can go ahead and run the class you can see that has also been compiled and this works also so this is how you set the path class path okay you can set the class path as well and home uh, java home path as well so basically class you need to have either class path or home class home uh, java home path and once you have so in class path let me go ahead and show you so basically in class path what you do go to environment variable and here you simply say new under system variable and then you say class path and here you say bin uh, lib not bin okay so in lowercase lib and then you say like this backslash uh, s to means everything whatever is here and then say jr jar and that's how you set a class path for uh, what do you what, what do you call it java <laughs> so that's it for this video thank you so much for watching this video please like share and subscribe to my channel if you have issue compiling and running java code uh, if you're getting any specific error please leave in the comment and i will try to answer it asap thank you so much for watching this video please like share and subscribe to my channel have a good day bye for now